Aiming with a sports rifle sight is a really interesting story. It consists of nothing more than a rear sight and a front sight. On the rear sight we find a diopter with something like a 1mm opening. At the front sight we find a ring with round about 4mm blinding circle. With this instrument you can aim as exact as with an expensive rifle scope. If you see the whole competition, this means if you shoot 60 shot, you may be even more accurate with a sports rifle sight. To get this performance in shooting, it's necessary to know and to understand all the rules of aiming. It's important to find the right instruments and it's important to adjust them exactly to what you need and what your target needs according to the light and the darkness and the color of light on the target. We have tried to bring all problems of aiming on one picture, on one poster. Uh, this you find here and you can download it for nothing on my website which is heinzreinkemeyer.de The front part of a sport rifle consists of a tube like this. On the tube we find a rail and on this rail the front side is connected. I open the screw here so we can go forward and backward with the position of the tunnel. The more forward we are the longer the sighting line is and the more accurate sighting will be. When we go back we lose a little bit of exactness and the ring inside will look a little bit bigger. So if we have a corn of 3.5 millimeters here it will look like a 3.3. The two sticks inside the tunnel can be moved by the front ring here. So I can go a little bit to the left or a little bit to the right according to my canting of the rifle. This can be done during shooting, even in competition, just with one touch to the tunnel. If you want, you can take them out and then you have just the picture of the ring. Tunnel you get in three different forms. The conventional made from metal, the modern transparent ones and the free ones who carry the corn and filter or whatever in a second frame. Tunnels you get in two different diameters. On the right side you see a conventional M18 which is 18 millimeters in diameter. On the left side you see a 22 millimeter diameter tunnel. Normally every shooter will be satisfied with the 18 millimeter the 22 is made for German support shooters who need a lens in a special competition. Here we see a conventional front side on the right uh, side which is made just from metal 
the ring is holded by two strings just to keep it uh, together. On the left side we see a modern uh, front side which consists of a tube, a plastic tube with a screw. The front side itself is made from a glass disc and inside this glass disc we have an insert of metal. This is very precise and has the best optical skills. On the front side we find the size of the ring, 4.3 millimeters in this case, and the thickness of the ring, here 1.2. This can be seen during shooting with one view to the tunnel.